What's up, people in the mind of a jerk, and I'm bringing you my new series today. Um, it's going to be Road to Amal Buryat. Amal, Amal, Ribi. I could, I could say this before. Amal Buryat. Fuck's sake. Amal Ribia. Amal Ribia. Something like that, anyway. Basically, he's going to be a sub for my league BBVA team. I'll quickly go through my BBVA team. The main team is Casillas in goal. First informed Danny, no, second informed Danny Alves at right back. It sounds like it's the best Danny Alves, but it's technically not because the t team of the year one's better and the team of the year one's first. So basically, I've got the, the 89 Danny Alves um, uh, sitting right back, just cash. Um, then right centre back, I've got Pepe, centre back, PK, uh, left centre back, uh, Ramos, left back, um, I mean right wing back and right back, because uh, right wing back and left wing back, because I play five two two one. Because the BBVA doesn't have many pacey uh, defenders, as you can tell, apart from Ramos. Anyway, so um, uh, yeah, so I'm a sweaty bastard, really. And um, uh, left back Marcelo, centre mid Xavi Iniesta. Uh, wait, let me just check. I'm, I'm, this is my trading account. I'm on my Xbox on the main account. That's my little skill hybrid. Let me just check my first team. Uh, Intimi Van is called. Um, same as this account's called. Uh, Chavi's off to the right and Yester's on the left. Then right wing I have um, <clears throat> um, Angel Di Maria. Striker I have uh, upgraded Benzema, not the 86 in form. Uh, and then left wing I've got David Villa. Um, subs I've got. So, sub key part, most of you probably guess, is Valdez. I've got Inform, Ram, Juan Fran at right back. It's got Disgusting, Defending, and Heading, but I've got three centre backs, so I don't really need it. Um, sub, sub left wing back is Marcelo. Uh, sub centre mids are Ozil and Kaka. Uh, I've got First Inform, Saldado. I've got Dominguez in form for my centre back. Pedro for left wing. And my two centre mids centre backs at the moment are. Ricardo Carvalho and the non-informed version of this guy. I don't know why I just went from my whole team, but there's um, if you just go, this is who I'm going to go for. He's the cheap, of, he's a cheap, pretty cheap player. Well, yeah, an informed considering I'm starting off with 5k, so I'm already a quarter the way there. But then I'm going to go for a bigger gun who comes from the same team. Um, let's just check him out. Um, oh fuck! Why won't it change? God's sake, go on S. Damn it, I don't know why I want to do that. Anyway, um, Spain. I don't know, I think my key will stop working. My keyboard has problems, just randomly stops working. The drivers, if you know what that is, is pretty shit in them. Uh, it's a pretty good keyboard, like 60 quid and all that. But basically, that's what I'm going for next, uh, 24k. Uh, he'll be the series after, I say he's about 24k. This is what I'm going for, easy to get mixed up with. They're basically, like, near the same flower. But yeah, basically, that's my team up and I went through that whole rundown and that's what I'm going to go for so basically I'm just going to show you how I'm going to find the players that I'm going to trade with this is one of several techniques I will most likely be using I will enter here silver and put this up to how many coins I have which is 5k damn it five one two three and then I'll just search through I'll once I'll be right back uh, when I think I found like an average deal and then I'll show you how I check but basically, I use my naked eye to check if it's an average deal, and then I use a database to check if it's a good deal. So I'll be right back in a sec, guys, when I find a deal that I reckon could could be decent. One sec, guys. Just pause the record. So, guys, I'm back. Um, I found a lands fame, just got to be quick. He's worth 1.8k, so I'm going to try and get him for about what I've just bidded. But it's in a good formation, so I might go for a bit while I ain't got no more than t uh, a cat, uh, two. I mean a K, because I'm probably going to average about 2K for him. But this guy's probably going to outbid me last second. Will he? Will he? Will he? And no, he hasn't. So there's a pretty good deal. Well, I tried to do this series a bit earlier on, but I was in prime time and I didn't really pick up any big deals. I picked up a few, like, 700 coin profits here and there, but that's pretty much a 1.1K profit. So I'm going to come back when I find one more deal that's worth checking up on the database. So, guys... Oh, there's one here straight away. Don't even need to pause the recording. Right, that looks cheap to me, so I'm just going to check up his price, is it? I think, fuck, not like that, like that. My keyboard is working. <laughs> Montoya, is that it? Montoya, yeah, that's right. So I'm just going to wait for this to load. It's taking a bit longer because I'm recording. Right, let's just check. I think he's worth about 
1.3, 1.4k, I'm not too sure, so that's not really the best deal. Yeah, 1.4k, not a bad guess, eh? I'll put it 700, because I aim to try and make a k profit, but on these lower players, about 600, 700 coins are perfect. So let's put pretty much all I'm going to put in for that. I'm not sure, oh, I didn't mean to put that lens of fame up, but whatever, I'll just send them to the trade pile and I'll put them up after. So let's just send that to the trade pile. So basically, that's how I find my players, guys. Yeah, I didn't really mean to put that lens of fame up, but guys, that's how I find my players. That's just a brief insight. I'll come back when I've spent the rest of this money and then I'll show you what I list them for. And then at the start of the next episode, you will be able to see if they sold or not. So guys, uh, I'll be right back when the whole of the trade pile is full or not the whole of the trade pile when all this 3.4k is spent. So guys, I'll be, I'll be. Uh, sorry about that guys, uh, you probably just saw like a second for three seconds back then with no, like, no speaking, that was me, I started it again, unpaused it and then realised that my mic was still muted, but anyway guys, uh, so we picked up a Lands of Fame, where is he, oh, if this load, yeah, we picked up a Lands of Fame for 8.50 and Let's just type him in. Lands of Fame, 850. So that's about a K on that. So there's 1K profit. Oh, damn it. Fuck's sake, click. Oh, yeah, yeah. Check the rest. And then I bought a Montoya. Toy. I think that's it, yeah. 1.4. And I paid. Uh, when did I pay? There we go, there. So there was that. 800. No. Fucking hell, 700, it's late guys, I'm not the best at maths. 1.7k profit there, so this bad dude. I probably added that up wrong, made myself look like an idiot. More my 1.7, add 4, so um, what's that? 2.1 obviously, uh, then Olsen. I think that's... How the fuck do you spell it? I've already lost count, fucking hell, I don't know, I don't know, but that's, it's just, I'll just go through the profits, I don't, I don't even know why I'm trying to add them up, it's too late, uh, 3.5k, so that's about a k, k profit after tax, and Proto, which was actually a pretty decent deal there, I paid 300, oh, I paid 750, so that's a bit like, quite a decent deal, nearly like, let's just say 1.5k profit, so it was a pretty decent amount of profit to be had here from four silver players, that's if they'll sell, I hope they all do, anyway guys, uh, I'll just uh, quickly list them, and then, so that's worth 3.5k, so it's a shit formation, so I'll put them up for 3.4, here's a little tip guys, say I went to buy a player and saw 3.5k buy now, I think that's quite steep, but then 3.4k, it's like, sounds cheaper, it's kind of weird, but it actually is, that's why, like, most shops always sell things for £1.99, not £2, just a bit of random shiz there but 2.3k that is so let's just type in 2.2 or should I put him up for 1.9 and I'll put him up, he's a ship formation so I'll put him up for 1.9 bin and then Montoya Toya uh, 1.4k is in a pretty decent formation so I'll put him up for 1.8 optimism is not too shabby guys it's not bad to be optimistic so there we go that's all a proto sold straight away fucking hell 1.9k straight away 2.3 it said he's worth i mean oh, so and it's a shit formation so i didn't really call myself and there you go you've already seen that from uh what's it called you've already seen that for the next episode guys anyway so i'm just gonna add up how much profit averagely that i should make uh for the, to the end of this episode if all goes to plan then i'll tell you how much i actually did next episode when they've all sold so guys i'll be right back to the last part of the video where i should where i estimate how much profit that i should have all right i'll be right back guys one sec guys, I've just forgot, um, I bought a Badu as well, there's him there, I bought him 400 coins, and um, he's off about 9, 9.19, so I'll put him up for 9.50, just using that little trick to make it look a bit cheaper, so guys, I've put those up, um, <laughs> I was adding up, um, what's it called, uh, how much profit I'm averagely making, and I just realised I bought a Badu and didn't thingy, so I'm still coming back with the average profit that I should make, and that'll end off the video guys, see you in a sec. So guys, I'm sorry this episode has dragged on a bit and I've still got a few coins left, but that was from the pro sale. So, uh, but so you won't be seeing him sold next episode, just remember that he sold and all that. But if all goes to plan, I should make five point 
well, like 5,050 coins from, what is it, four players, that's, no, five players, that's not too bad, guys, anyway, uh, I'm out, see you later, sorry this video was so long, but, um, I'm going to try and shorten them down, uh, because this is the first episode of Talk to Like the Gibberish, where I have to explain what we're going for and all that, but basically, guys, I'm going to try and aim for six minutes on these videos, anyway, I'm out, peace.